Sony Santa Monica just released a teaser trailer for the God of War Raising Kratos documentary with the following footage at the end. So yes, everyone, including me, went nuts for a while. Is this God of War 2, a teaser trailer, PlayStation 5 graphics? But Corey Barlock, the director of God of War, of course, already took it to Twitter to say that this was the original pre-rendered teaser trailer for God of War 2018 that they wanted to hide on the God of War 3 remastered PS4 release that, of course, released one year before the official reveal of God of War but that they ran out of time so this teaser trailer ended up on the shelf. A few days ago Sony shared substantial PlayStation 5 details in a random Wired article. So them already teasing the next God of War with a sick looking trailer is totally not out of the realm of possibility, but that is sadly not what this is. I thought it was interesting to make this video to clear it up if you just watched the documentary trailer and were like what the heck is this? Well it's not what we expected. Because of course overall it's not a question of if, but when we get a new God of War game, although it will very likely take a few years before we see Kratos again. Recently we had Jason Schreier from Kotaku, who is of course known for his many correct leaks in the past. Well he now said that a new God of War game is also coming. Not really that it's a surprise, but still I thought it was worth noting. He said that on Reddit, where people were talking about the recent Horizon 2 leak, where an actor leaked the existence of the game at the Star Wars celebration. She was like talking to a fan, and then she said some things that she likely should not have. But yeah, if we take a step back, I can totally see why they don't want to put this big reveal at the end of a documentary trailer because this will be a huge E3 or PlayStation experience moment, but they could have predicted the outcome of teasing this at the end of the documentary trailer without any context. So this was part of the God of War Racing Kratos announcement trailer because today God of War is one year old, the game released on April 20th, 2018, and we can soon see how the developers really made this masterpiece and one thing they show in the announcement trailer is that God of War reveal at E3 2016 with Kratos stepping out of the shadows she taught you to hunt yes yes sir then show me what you know I am I was lucky enough to be in that theater when they revealed that. What a show that was. Days Gone was revealed there as well and way, way more. And that is what Corey also added on Twitter later, saying that it was such a good twist of fate to unveil the game at E3 instead of on the disc of the God of War 3 Remastered. And that's why I also think that big shows like E3 are still important to Sony, even though they skip, of course, this year, because it must be amazing to see fans react to a game that you have been working on for a really long time. I can totally imagine that. So want to know how they made God of War? Well, this documentary will be coming soon to the PlayStation YouTube channel. Really cool to see that they planned this documentary from the beginning because we should see the whole five years of development. They've done some other things to celebrate the one year anniversary of this game though. A character pack with avatars is available to download and also a cool dynamic team that has some secrets as well, hinting that Ragnarok is coming. And of course, if you finished God of War and watched the secret ending, then you know what I'm talking about. But again, we will likely have to wait a few years before we can play this continuation. There will be no God of War DLC coming. That much is already confirmed as well. So the team is likely already working on this next game. And I would not be surprised if we maybe already saw it next year. So two years after the original release. PlayStation 5 reveal event. Have Kratos show his face and people will already go nuts. As we saw at E3 2016 as well. But yeah, I also thought before the tweet from Corey Barlock. Are they really going to tease God of War 2 before Horizon 2? What a crazy time that would be, but no, 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 I don't think that that will happen. When we do know more about the inevitable God of War 2 and of course Horizon 2, then I'll let you know here on the channel. So totally subscribe to stay up to date on all the PlayStation exclusive news. Check out my previous video on Sony teasing what the price for the PS5 might be or all the details that Sony shared in that already mentioned Wired article. For now, I'll speak to you next time and goodbye.